are going to be going inside of the rodeo meat market. It's a little Spanish. Little hey, carneseria rodeo. There we go. It's on North, Northern and Lake, right on the corner. Yes. This All right, is one of our go. favorite places to come and shop. Why don't you guys stand in front and remember your shirt? You guys are speaking and getting stuff out of my way. Uh, I wanted to. Okay, right here. What are these? Not you and your mom they have a little bit of everything um, of the Mexican sorts. I believe these are bizcochitos. These little homemade cookies, those are abs ab <coughs> absolutely delicious. <laughs> oh, they've never tried them. Uh -huh. These yeah. cookies are pretty awesome. I don't know if you've ever tried any of those little chippy things, but those are good with hot sauce on it. And then we did come for, we decided to come for the um, pan dulces. So before we leave, we'll probably come back over here and show you guys some of these. We plan on getting at least one or two. Yes. Maybe three. Maybe. So here in this little Mexican store, they have a little bit of everything. They have the spices and some, you know, stuff to sell physical wise over there. And then our spices in the back, all the good type of spices that you don't normally find anywhere else. You could probably get here if you're Hispanic or whatever and need that for your little Hispanic dishes. A little bit of everything. Um, so all our Mexican drinks, favorite place. Yes. They got them all cold. Very much cool. If you like the Clamato, they got the Clamato over here. The aloe vera drinks, the square bottles. I know some people that have asked for those, they have them here of all different sorts. Mango, melon, strawberry, coconut, some pomegranate up there. They're pretty good. Our favorite, the Jarito drinks, they got mango, pineapple, grapefruit, mandarin? I think lime. Yeah, mandarin. Uh, guava, punch, watermelon. Watermelon, and strawberry. And then they have the Mexican Cokes up there, Mexican sodas in a bottle. Those are my favorites. Reminds me of Mexico. We've got the Nectar drinks. This is the Tres Leches. Ooh, yes. I think they do it homemade. So if you guys like that Tres Leches, they have them here. They're pretty tasty. I love them. In, the in a regular plastic. They got them in a regular plastic. Oh my god, you guys, you guys to get Oh my god, why? Oh, you guys yes. gotta try this. If you like coconut, you gotta try it. Big These big. are one of my favorite drinks. Yeah. We got the regular soda. So, like in any, to me, for me, in any Mexican store that you go to, you're gonna have their type of cookware, their type of, well, their type of food that they use. I believe it's like probably imported from Mexico. A lot of the stuff, like they have the Mexican name on it right away, you know what I mean? Like, it has a Mexican name on it, so I'm assuming it's coming from Mexico or at least Texas, something like that, somewhere close to that. But all their stuff is what you're not going to get regularly at a Walmart or a King Super. Okay. So it happens to be one of our favorites to come and get all the good stuff. Some papaya, no? Right? Yeah, papaya. Yeah. Regular avocados looks like the avocados is on the yeah, artwork. They have all there, and then they have the jugs. The jugs over there too. You got the tortilla shells. The most amazing part, the special, the the store. They said jugs. Tortillas. They do. They straight took our name. Wait, what did what they say? That was the name of our restaurant. Wow. All the but it's the name. Mexican name. I like these. 
the corn tortilla press, you want a baby street taco, this is what you'll use if you're making the street tacos from home. If you want a with your huge masa. one. That's a regular size corn tortilla. But you put a little plastic here so that way the masa doesn't get all over the, the wood and then you push it, put the little ball of masa and, and it's done. The ones that we had were metal, all metal. Little. I want to get one of those too. Cu cups, coffee, coffee cups. cups. We got our canned food right here. All their pots and pans. I like these little dishes that they have. They're cute. Those are the regular metal ones. Is that a rolling? Put a knife or something. Mix it with laundry. All the food. Hot sauces. The chamoy. Oh god, mom. They have, I never knew that they had um, sugar free chamoy. They have some sugar free chamoy here, but this is where we normally get our chamoy, and then we get the tahini from here as well. It's a huge tooth. I know, it's huge. Look at that. Why? Dude, you don't laugh. Oh god. Oh, but yeah, so. Coconut milk. I don't know if have yet. If you guys have not tried it, you gotta try it. It's my favorite. My favorite. Uh, on this side, we got all the. Uh, cookies, all the desserts, oh sweeties. Which my grandma's favorite. My grandma, yeah, that one's my grandma's favorite. My grandma from Mexico. Those are good. That was the one that she always had Those underneath the bed in the sewing, uh, sewing uh, bucket I tin. <laughs> you thought it was the sewing needle and stuff, but it was no, it was it was a cookie. So I don't know if you want to do like a real quick. As soon as everyone leaves off of the off of the meat window. I want to go by it real quick. How do you throw a demo? If you do like all that Mexican candy stuff, you got to come try. This one is a pepino, pico pepino. So that's a, like a spicy cucumber. This one is the watermelon slice. And of course, it's gonna have the chili all over it. Um, let's see, these are different. I've never tried any of these. Maybe we'll have to do another video soon with some new candies. This one's a mix. It's gonna have like the, I think Mango. this is the corn. The corn, the, there's the ilota, the mango. This one's the mango. I think this one's the watermelon one. And I don't know which one that was. We gotta try that one. Apparently, they have a Takis one. Little marshmallow yeah, cones. Those, those look pretty interesting. Have you ever tried these? I mean, it's all marshmallows. It's, it's a marshmallow sucker, but a lot of people like them. These look good, though. <laughs> Ooh, these do look good. Let's see. It looks like a wafer, though. Hazelnut and cocoa. They look pretty warm, guys. Big old marshmallow. What else? So the mango pepper and butter pepper. Wow, those ones are jelly. The little mini fruit. Frutas, the little mini frutas. I'm assuming you could do these. These are plain. These are the ones with chili slice or chili spice on it. But you could put like on the plain ones, the hot sauce and stuff. Same with these. Like some people eat them like that, but some people have to put this, the hot sauce and the lime on it, which I like with the hot sauce, of course. The huge one. You know, they get these, they get these and like open the side of it. They open the side of it and then sit it, sit it like a plate and then they put all that stuff, the chamoy, the tahini and all the, like we need to find a place that, yeah, we need to find a place that does all that. Because that would be super cool. I think this is a tamarindo. It's a tamarindo burrito. <laughs> that looks good. I want to bite into it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> These are look pretty good. You guys got to come check out this place over here on Northern. Big old. It's one of our favorite places. That looks good. I want that right now. Actually, I'm going to save this because I'm taking it home with me. <laughs> but yeah, you guys got to come by. They have a little bit of everything. All kinds of good stuff. 
come by just to give a business. They do have a meat market as well. So, what else, guys? These are, I don't know what these are, it's just like, what is it, the Lucas? Those are our favorites. De la Rosea. Some lime salt, spicy, boo boo loo boo, wait, boo boo, boo ba loo, boo ba loo, that's gum. The Dublin, Dublin is pretty good, that's good. Oh god, we got this whole shelf of pans. Did you guys see the piñatas? I believe they do those in my hand. Look, it's a pretty tall one. This is cute. There's a unicorn one. Is that a chunk over there? It's like a super chunk one. Check it out. Is anybody over there that do you like a real quick walkthrough about shopping? Thank you. 